Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure everybody remembers the FAO from the OG Modern Warfare 2 or even some of the newer Modern Warfare's as well. And I'm going to tell you today, ladies and gentlemen, that it is back inside of Call of Duty Mobile. In fact, it was never back, but the gun's back in general inside of a Call of Duty Mobile game. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and take a look at this thing. So what we have to do is actually go into the training room. If you guys don't know how to get your hands on these new guns and test them out before they drop into the game, training room is definitely the best bet for that. And then from there, you're going to be on this page. You're going to click the yellow swap indicator. And then it's an assault rifle so we're gonna scroll way down and as you guys can see the lag 53 or the fal so we're gonna go ahead and try it out now and we can take a look at the gunsmith from this tab so it looks like with muzzles we have tactical suppressor owc light suppressor monolithic pretty standard there and as for the barrels we got marksman we got this uh para and then an ultra light i don't know i think i don't know how this is gonna work out chat i'm gonna be real looks like for all the sites they're pretty much standard here stocks are interesting so we do have a no stock option we got an aluminum stock option and then we got a close quarters and then the forge tax stock looks like for the laser standards lasers as well and then as for the foregrips we have pretty much essential just basic foregrips and for the magazines we do have a 24 round option and a 30 round option obviously i think the 30 round might be your best bet and then as for the rear grips we have grand lid stippled and rubberized which is pretty standard there as well and then of course for the perks everything is just the same all right man so now that we got to look at the first gun first impressions of this i'm kind of missing with the iron side tell me real i haven't shot the gun yet so it looks like it is a semi-auto yeah, that's kind of nice. I like that. Definitely like the semi-auto effect. I don't know, man. I like the fact that I can hold this down and I don't have to manually tap it. You know what I mean? All right, let's get it. Let's get a weapon inspect going here. Nice. Beautiful gun. Beautiful gun, chat. I don't know how it's doing. So it looks like it's like three shotting. Let's see. One, two. Okay, that was that was like a two and a half. Really, I don't know what that was. One, two. That's a two shot. That's definitely a two shot at that range. Once again, I'm gonna go for this like further back target. One, two. That's a two shot, bro. That's at least 20 meters. All right, let's see what this thing's hitting for on the dummy here. 54 to the upper chest. 45. 45 to the whole entire arm. Grommy got 54. 45 to the leg. 45 to the lower leg. 45 to the foot. And then for the headshot, we're going to be doing 67. It's weird because I'm holding this down and it's literally a uh, two tapping. The wall now. So let's see what this is doing. 30. 37 not bad man i'm gonna go to the, the complete thickest wall we can actually do it doesn't go through it man looks like medium might be our best bet here as well let's take a look at the medium wall here it's going through medium but it just doesn't go through the high one all right yeah so once again this is the lag first looks first impressions i'm kind of liking it man i'm not gonna lie definitely a solid gun right now everyone was downing it but i think if you have accuracy it might cook chat all right so what we're gonna do right now is actually build the gun out how i probably would build it inside of rank for like any pretty much any map in any scenario i'm gonna build it for this and i'll see you guys when we get the build all right ladies and gentlemen this is the build we got on the lag a lot slower a lot quieter man but it's still it's still hitting bro i'm not gonna lie this build is definitely a lot slower of a build it's it's pretty much more of a long range build but dude we used to be hitting 34 for the body. Now we're hitting 54 for the body. 67 to the head. Let's let's bring this back to 30 meters and see what we can really do and capitalize with this kind of build. Let's see. 36, yeah. I mean, even at that range, it'd probably still two tap, bro. That's crazy. Well, obviously, it's going to be different when it's in rank, but 30s, 40s, 50s, dude, it's definitely going to be two tapping at that range. This weapon has the potential to be broken, possibly after a buff, maybe. I'm actually liking this chat. I'm not going to lie. But that's a new look at the LAG 53. This is definitely a different gun that we've seen inside of Call of Duty Mobile. It's more of a DMR than it is an assault rifle, but I'm definitely excited for it. So with that being said, if you guys enjoyed today's video, you got a first look and impressions of the LAG. Drop a like down below, hit subscribe for more, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.